This video is going to be really informative and interesting because I'm going to talk about what is corrosion, what are corrosion types and what steps we should take to prevent corrosion. Let's start. Corrosion is a natural process that involves the gradual deterioration of materials, especially metals, due to chemical reactions with their environment. It is often associated with the reaction of metals with oxygen in the presence of moisture or other corrosive agents. The most common form of corrosion is the rusting of iron or steel, where iron reacts with oxygen and water to form iron oxide or rust. Corrosion can occur through various mechanisms. Here are different types including Uniform corrosion. This type of corrosion results in a relatively even loss of material over the entire surface of metal. It occurs when the metal reacts uniformly with the surrounding environment. Galvanic corrosion. Also known as bimetallic corrosion. This occurs when two different metals are in electrical contact with immersed in an electrolyte such as liquid that conducts electricity like water. One metal acts as an anode and corrodes more rapidly while the other acts as a cathode and remains relatively protected. Pitting corrosion. Pitting is localized corrosion that leads to the formation of small holes or pits on the metal's surface. It can be especially damaging because the pits can penetrate deep into the material weakening its structural integrity. Crevice corrosion. This type of corrosion occurs in confined spaces or crevices where stagnant water or moisture can accumulate. The lack of oxygen renewal in these areas accelerates corrosion. Stress corrosion cracking. This type of corrosion happens when a metal is subjected to both tensile stress, stretching and a corrosive environment. It can lead to the sudden failure of the metal even under lower stresses than it would normally endure. Intergranular corrosion. This occurs along the grain boundaries of a metal due to variations in composition along those boundaries, making them more susceptible to corrosion. Corrosion can have serious consequences, including structural damage, reduced lifespan of materials, and increased maintenance costs. To prevent corrosion, various protective measures can be taken such as applying coatings, using corrosion resistant alloys, employing cathodic protection and reducing moisture controlling pH. Click here to subscribe to watch more videos. Until my next video, take care and bye.